I mean, we got stories back of people right on the edge of suicide. Mm. And, and like, but sometimes like 70 year old people mm -hmm. who, who, uh, there was a guy, Alf, who we named the character mm. after in Exodus, who um, played Abe's Odyssey and sent us this like 14 page handwritten letter. You're not going to believe this, but I had to tell you, your game saved my life. Mm. And then he goes through this whole thing, right? And just to touch on it, because um, these, I think, are the possibilities when we have good content. I felt like Star Wars kind of saved my life because mm. through Yoda, I became less cynical, mm -hmm. you know, and, and, I, and I believed it. I kind of bought into that. Uh, so Alf, we get this letter and this guy is 70, I think at the time he was 72 mm. years old. And he goes, you, you, you just give me the chance to read this because you should know mm. this is what happened with me. So here's a guy, he had been in World War II, uh, you know, Engl in England, he was a veteran, survived the war, uh, was a truck driver for years till eventually retired, uh, led a humble life. His wife wound up with a debilitating disease, spent the last like eight years nurturing her eventually, you know, into the grave. Mm -hmm. And had lost all sense of hope, become really cynical, was disengaged from his grandkids, was uh, just, just felt he had absolutely nothing left. And he had decided when she died, he was like, yeah, it's time for me to go too. And uh, he was, you know, drinking a lot. And uh, he, so so he, he, he can't do it. And he has a service revolver and he's writing this, this mm -hmm. and he can't do it. And he goes, I, I can't, I just can't pull the trigger and I'm mad at myself and I figure why is that why am I so weak I can't do what I need mm -hmm. to do and he said maybe it's because I still have some money left in a bank and so he goes he goes I'm just gonna go spend it on the stupidest thing and that'll do it and then I'll be ready so he goes in he goes to the store and he sees the PlayStation mm -hmm. and he sees Abe right Abe on the ex on the first game he's just this kind of dopey looking guy <laughs> on the cover that looks sad you know yeah. kind of cute and uh he said uh he said, and I just thought, I'm buying a PlayStation and I'm going to buy that guy there. The, you know, it was like the, the the reason we designed him was the reason he attracted to him. It was like he just felt like I could relate to him. Mm -hmm. you know? And then he goes home and he's really just trying to e exhaust his resistance to committing suicide. Mm -hmm. But he starts playing our game. Mm -hmm. and, he, and, and one thing that we had built in uh, very intentionally was infinite lives. Because mm -hmm. I, I wanted, I didn't want the experience where you were told you weren't good enough, do it all over again. Mm -hmm. Do it all over yeah. again. I wanted the experience that was like, you almost got there. Mm -hmm. Keep going, man. You'll get mm -hmm. there. You know, that that notion. And uh, so he starts engaging it and he said, I start doing something that I hadn't done in a long time. Yeah. Laughing. Mm -hmm. He goes, I started laughing mm -hmm. and I got engaged. And every day I started playing and I, was at, and I started laughing more. And then I got reached out and I contacted my granddaughters and i asked them if they had heard of this and then uh you know and he just, and it goes in mm -hmm. i mean when we read this you know one of the uh the gals that was working on marketing got mm -hmm. it and read it to the company mm -hmm. we were all crying mm -hmm. i mean it was like wow what this guy went through and what goofy little abe you know did for him and he's trying to really convince us like believe me man this is true mm -hmm. like this happened and it, and your game did it I've gotten so many other uh, stories. Well, he wound up on a BBC. Mm -hmm. He wound up on CNN, I believe. Uh, so they did some specials on him because we were like, this, this guy's story is amazing. <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, and then eventually, you know, he died, <laughs> he died of <laughs> reasonable causes. Sure, right. Right. <laughs> but, uh, but he was, you know, so we named our guy after him. And everything, he's like, and after another drink of brandy, I did this. So we had Elf <laughs> be the head of the 12-step group. You know? That's awesome.